pakailah bajuku. Mancing kita mancing. Morning Arthur. Jatahnya berhari-hari. Morning, Mr. Morgan. Hi, Arthur. Come here a minute. What is it? Good. Good for you. Can I ask you a favor? Probably not. Very funny. Would you do something with Jack? He seems kind of Jack. Down. All this upheaval can't have been easy on the poor kid. Why? Because I'm your preferred nursemaid? Because he likes you, and, well, you know his father's useless. Okay. Thank you. Panggak sama bapak kau. Kenapa harus kita? Dia ada bapaknya. Kita oh udah lupa sering jarang nyumbang makanan lagi kita ya. Oi kit. What you up to? Playing. Anything fun? I guess. You wanna come fishing with me? Fishing? Sure. You're. It's about time that you started to earn your keep. Okay. Good. Let's go get your pole then. Oh, you do have a fishing pole, don't you? I sure do. Uncle Jose made me one. Good. Well, let's go get it then. Go catch us some fish. <laughs> yeah. Emang di kuda kita ada alat pancing atur. I'll mount up and lift you on when you're ready. Kotor di berdebu. Okay. Di depan dia Jack. Down to the river near here. We shouldn't go too far from camp. Oh, okay. You feeling better? I know you was a little sick. Oh, I'm fine. You're a brave kid. So, just like you. Well, I don't know about brave. I ain't much of a kid no more. Well, your mama might disagree, 
Turn a few other women, I guess. What do you mean? Uh, I'm just talking silly. <laughs> Been a tough few weeks up in that snow. I like the snow. Yes, but not like that. When are we going back to the other camp? The one near Blackwater? Yeah. Well, we're not. This is our spot. For now, anyway. Why? I forgot a storybook there. We left so quick. Well, I'm sure someone can get you another storybook. Really? When? Well, <laughs> we'll see. Got fish to catch first. Yep. Drift. Not drift kita sama horse. Are we going the right way? Right back, Uncle Arthur. <laughs> All right. You see that there? Ini. Mancing apa kita? You can't fish without a pole. First, we need some bait. Speed. I'm gonna use some cheese. Cheese? Bellier the better. Now, cast your line, swing the rod back over your shoulder, and bring it forward in a smooth motion. Use your wrist, not your elbow. for a fish to take the bait. How do I know when I've got a bite? Well, if you feel the tip of your fishing rod just twitching, don't yank it yet. That just means one's nibbling. If you feel a hard tug, that's a fish going for the bait, so yank hard to hook it. I think you've got a bite. Look. Got one, Jack. Pull him in. You see him fighting there, Jack? That's when you gotta be careful. You, you'll break the line. Best to wear them out first before you try to reel them in. Now, it seems like he's taking a rest now. I'm gonna try reeling them in nice and steady. This is a great fishing spot. Don't jinx it, kid. You okay there? I think so. This is hard. Why am I not catching any? Just be patient. My arms are tired. You're all right. You know, this reminds me. 
I taught another boy to fish once. A long time ago. You mean Lenny? <laughs> no, no. No, this was long before I met Lenny. Long before you was even born. Look, Jack, get your small mouth back. It's almost as small as you. We should really throw these smaller ones back. Give them a chance to grow up a bit. Can I take a break from fishing? I want to make something. Okay. I'm gonna pick some of those red flowers. I'll be right back. See what's biting there. Slow there. There we go. It's it. This one's a bluegill. <laughs> Not bad. Fishing sure is boring, Uncle Arthur. I know. Born as hell. But then, something happens. And you can get food for days. Really? If you're lucky. But until then, you just sit and wait and try not to worry. It's good for you. It's good for you? I guess. Huh. You got a stick at things, Jack. I know. Ah, didn't hook. Uncle Arthur! There, got him! What are you making there? You'll see. It's a surprise. Kecil kali. Ikan yang tadi juga. Hey, look at this. And what? This necklace I made. Necklace? For Mama. Sure. What a fine young man. And in such complex circumstances. Arthur, isn't it? Arthur Morgan? Who are you? Yes, Arthur Morgan, Vanderlyn's most trusted associate. You've read the files. Typical case, orphaned street kid seduced by that maniac's silver tongue and matures into a degenerate murderer. Agent Milton, Agent Ross, Pinkerton Detective Agency, seconded to the United States government. Nice to finally meet. We know a lot about you. Do you? You're a wanted man, Mr. Morgan. It's five thousand dollars for your head alone. Huh. Five thousand dollars? For me? Can I turn myself in? We want Vanderlyn. Old Dutch. I haven't seen him for months. That's so? Because I heard a guy fitting his description robbed a train belonging to Leviticus Cornwall up near Granite Pass. Oh, ain't that a little old-fashioned nowadays? Apparently not. Listen. This is my offer, Mr. Morgan. Bring in Vanderlyn, and you have my word you won't swing. Oh, I ain't gonna swing anyways, Agent uh, Milton. You see, I haven't done anything wrong, aside from not play the games to your rules. Spare me the philosophy lesson. I've already heard it from Mac Callender. 
My calendar. He was pretty shot up by the time I got to him. So really, it was more of a mercy killing. Slow, but merciful. Slow. <laughs> you enjoy being a rich man's toy, dear. I enjoy society, flaws and all. You people venerate savagery, and you will die. Savagely, all of you. Oh, we're all gonna die, Agent. Some of us, sooner than others. Good day, Mr. Morgan. Goodbye. Enjoy your fishing, kid. While you still can. <laughs> Who are they? No one to worry about. No one at all. Come on. Let's pick up your things and get home. <laughs> it's getting late, Jack. Your mother will be worried. Let's head back. disagreeable man and I don't want them to hurt him what did they mean about Matt is he in jail uh, no I don't uh, think so I hope he's just fine where he is like I said don't worry about them the world is full of disagreeable men that's why you got all of us to protect you from folk like them now, how about that necklace you made? You still got it, right? Yeah, I got it. Good. Well, did you like fishing? It was... okay, I think. It's a lot of waiting around. It is. this necklace ain't that pretty ain't i the luckiest did you thank uncle arthur no need we had a good time what's wrong nothing just met some folk i better go speak with dutch okay hey you did real fine kid thanks yalah kasih tahu dutch pindah pindah kota lagi lo kita what i just met some guys out near the river a fella named uh, um, Milton and uh, I don't remember the other fella's name. Ross. Milton and Ross. And? and they are employees of the Pinkerton Detective Agency. And they know about the train and they know we're here. Were you followed back here? No. They know we're near here. And they want you, Dutch. They offered me my freedom in exchange, they did. Why didn't you take it? <laughs> Very funny. Well, what do we do now? I say we do nothing just yet. They're just trying to scare us into doing something stupid. We have turned a corner. We survived them mountains. We just need to stay calm. Let's cabut kita. That's. Mission complete. Apa kita? Nothing, Miss Grimshaw. Mm. That's for the best. 
Sure. Of course. I never did like her very much. Cuma joget-joget eh, kau tanya mak-mak.